All right, here we are on the tried and true raise. Whoa, that's 100%. All right. So when was the last time I updated this? I still love my raise. Three months ago, 4.2.3. So let's uh, update this script. All right, so we got the latest build. Update all installed packages. Let's do it. Yes. Always remember to back up your images. Yes, I backed it up already. And let it go. All right, we're now all updated. Uh, let's just make sure we got everything working correctly. A good, some good tests. Metal slug. Let's just try a metal slug X, for example. Load this up really quick. Let's try a couple of the games. A lot of people say, you know, the final alpha breaks a little bit, or the um, because it's using the work just fine. Should have no issues with it whatsoever. Here we go. Thank you. Heavy machine gun. Get the cat. Get the cat. Jesus, him and his little rat. Oh, almost. Dang, that fatality, though. Finally, 1-1. One, one. Jesus. <laughs> all right. So there you have it. Rays all updated. Something to watch out for when you're updating these images is just, you know, a track mode What has been updated. Let's go ahead and go in there, actually. I don't want to see that. Getting in track mode, go to RetroPie, restart in a track mode. That should reboot it. All right, and then here we are in a track mode with all of our collections, all sorts of collections. Cave, CPS 1, 2, and 3, Atari, MSX, all the systems. When you click into a system, you get rooms like this, little different consoles, different previews with the snaps. I like the rooms a lot. I think the rooms are cool. And when you load a game, it goes into the game just like it would in Emulation Station. It's a really cool theme if you're running like a bar top especially. Uh, if you have a large collection of stuff, you know, a track mode isn't necessarily the most uh, easy to navigate, especially when you got hundreds of stuff. So there you go, and you can just start select out, and then you're back in a track mode. Pretty cool, right? You got your main console menus, and if you want to shut down, just hard hold down your analog stick, go to a track mode setup, and shut down. So there you have it, 4.2.13 all updated with the track mode, running nice. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys on the next one.